Let's imagine for a moment that you just got your first paycheck. It's pretty exciting, isn't it? Now, you've got enough money to do whatever you want. But hold on a minute, that's a dangerous mentality to live by. In fact, it's even more concerning if you've lived with this mentality for so long. Well, all that is about to change. Today, we will help you see 15 things you should focus on spending your money on. Your income shouldn't be about anything, Aluxer. Let's get right to it. Welcome to Alux. Number one, your health. Hey, you've heard the saying that goes, health is wealth, right? Of course you have. It's something about how the quality of your health can affect every single aspect of your life. Being critically ill will prevent you from putting the best effort into your life. So it goes without saying that your health, both mental and physical, deserves to be given 100% attention at all times. In the same vein, you must be willing to always spend on your health. Come on, why would you go ahead and buy concert tickets when you should have paid for a body test your doctor recommended? Make the right decisions about your health today and your older self will be so grateful. Number two, your home. Your home represents so much to us as humans. It's where we unwind, where we eat, rest, sleep, start a family, think, and also where we can be our true selves without judgment. A home represents more than just a roof over our heads. They are also fundamental parts of our lives. This is exactly why we must pay extra attention and, well, a little bit extra cash when it comes to choosing a home. In buying or renting a home, we must attempt to think of the future. Will this be a good place to raise kids? How close or far is this place to your office? How easily does it connect to other communities? In choosing a home, its cost shouldn't be the deciding factor. As long as it ticks every other box on your list, it wouldn't hurt to spend more money. Number three, a quality mattress. Hey, let's be honest, there's only a few things in life that beats a good night's sleep. Have you ever had a night's sleep that just felt different? The room has the right temperature, the night is still and quiet, and your mattress feels so perfect beneath you. Having a great night's sleep is not impossible. And the first step is having a comfortable mattress. We know what you're thinking. A comfortable mattress costs an arm and a leg. Well, that's the point of this video. Despite the cost of mattresses, you must be willing to pay the extra cost. When you really think about it, we cannot put a price on good sleep. So what's really stopping you? You should also know that individuals who sleep well are more likely to be better performers. Do you want to be a high performer? Here's a great starting point. Number four, healthy food and ingredients. Jim wakes up, takes his bath, brushes his teeth, and prepares for the day. Right after this, he begins to ponder on what he should have for breakfast. He is largely indecisive and decides to push this off until he finds something. It's 12 p.m. and Jim still hasn't eaten anything. Frustrated, he grabs a tub of ice cream and a pack of biscuits. Later that night, Jim repeats this same routine, eating something just as non-nutritious as his breakfast. Do you share similar qualities with Jim? We aren't judging because we know how difficult it is to make the right eating decisions. But here's a simple piece of advice from Alux. Spend as much as you can on food even if it costs way more than you expected. If you want the good stuff, you should definitely be willing to pay for it. Also, spending more on food will naturally give you more options to pick from. And that's a great start to eating healthy. Number five, your teeth. Growing up, most kids hated going to the dentist. Despite the promise of candy, it still seemed like our parents were thinking of inventive ways to punish us. Now, we are all grown and we think it's okay to ignore our dental health. It isn't. In fact, spending more on your teeth is a guaranteed way to prevent your teeth from falling out in your old age. Okay, falling out might sound a little bit extreme, but it's sure to improve your teeth as you grow older. So rather than go for the conventional toothbrushes, dental experts have advised more people to upgrade to sonic toothbrushes, which also have an ultraviolet sanitizer. Electric toothbrushes are almost a hundred times faster than a normal toothbrush, which suggests that they are more likely to clean your teeth more efficiently. Sounds good? Now's the time to invest in your toothbrush. Number six, your wardrobe. Who do you think will be taken more seriously in the office? A person who makes no effort to look good and professional or a person who always manages to look good? The latter, of course, but it isn't just about the office. You are more likely to be taken seriously if you are well-dressed. There's even a proverb that tells us to dress in the way that we want to be addressed. And that pretty much sums it up. If you wanna be addressed with respect, then you've gotta let that reflect in your outfit, but you really don't have to break the bank to get the right set of clothes. All you have to do is make sure you have more than two outfits for every kind of event. This means more than two outfits for casual outings with friends, for ceremonies, official events, family trips, and so on. You can also learn how to pair your clothes better, which gives you more options. Number seven, a car. Hold on, 
before you consider this as a sign to spend all your money on your dream car, give us a chance to properly explain ourselves. Spending more on a car doesn't mean you should pump all your money into buying the most expensive one on the market. What we are suggesting is for you to invest a large chunk of your time and effort into buying a car that fits into your lifestyle, even if it goes a little more than your budget. It is important to go for a car which has built a reputation for safety, cost-effectiveness, and overall reliability. If this means you have to spend a little more money, then so be it. Number eight, items that make your car safer. It's not enough to spend so much money on getting the right car, you also have to be willing to spend on your car's safety. Wait, are you super confident in your driving skills that you think this isn't important to you? Well, check out these stats. Over 38,000 deaths are recorded in the US every year, and more than four million people are also injured. Auto accidents affect all drivers with little regard to their driving skills. Don't invest so much in having a car that looks cool. Why not invest in something that provides you with maximum safety? Number nine, your education. Investing in your education isn't just about going back to college for your master's degree or becoming a professor. It's also about paying for online courses and certifications. All thanks to the internet, you can become certified in almost any field without ever stepping out of your home. All you need to do is pay for the course, which typically ranges from $10 to $200, depending on the complexity of the subject, and dedicate a certain number of hours each day. Number 10, charities. Hey, it's my money. Why should I bother with giving more to charities? Well, if you want true happiness, then you must learn to give without expecting anything in return. When you give to others, you have done a good thing and you have made another person happy. You have made another person see a reason to keep trying. But it's not just about the person receiving. Giving also fills the heart and mind with the right chemicals, with the most cardinal being endorphins. And this isn't all. Giving regularly to others will fill you with less stress, happiness, which in turn will result in lower blood pressure, higher self-esteem, and a lower chance of depression. Interestingly, you don't always have to give money to charities. You can offer to help with your knowledge, such as offering free classes to disadvantaged people, donating blood, or even giving out food to the homeless. There's always something you can give, and there's always some way you can help someone in need. Number 11, traveling. It would be pointless to go on and on about how expensive traveling can be, especially when you're visiting somewhere really far from home. But it wouldn't help to focus on the cost of traveling rather on the memories that would live with us for the rest of our lives. You don't want to spend your old age in regret, wishing you had taken all the trips you really wanted to. Take your lover to the Eiffel Tower or your entire family to the beautiful city of Malé in the Maldives. You can also go surfing or snorkeling in Cape Verde, sightseeing in Florence, or experience hunting in Las Vegas. Number 12 good books. A person who invests in good books has made a worthy investment in knowledge. This person has decided to improve their sense of imagination and explore countless portals into endless worlds. Books are also an effective way to learn new things. You can improve your financial knowledge by reading two or three books. You can also learn to bake, code, understand your emotions, and even get motivated to become your true self and achieve your wildest dreams. Books can change lives. They can inspire revolutions, they create history, and most importantly, they shape how we see the future. A large bowl of ice cream or a new book? You already know what we'd advise. Number 13, your future. If you spend money without making plans for your future, we kind of feel sorry for you. As much as we all love having a good time, it's equally important that we pay attention to our future. What investment plans do you have in place? What are your retirement plans? How do you plan to prevent your kids from insane student loans? Here's a simple trick. The earlier you start saving for retirement, the better it will be for you. We know how difficult it is to set aside a tiny chunk of your income each month, but if you really want a future of financial security, then you really should get started on that savings account. Number 14, your loved ones. Have you ever given your siblings, parents, or partner something they've always wanted? Can you remember the smile on their faces? Can you also remember how good it made you feel? Euphoric feeling, right? That's exactly why you should spend more money on your loved ones. And we both know that when it comes to your loved ones, you really do not have to break the bank. It's really the thought that matters. Number 15 gym membership or exercise equipment. When it comes to exercising, there are two major factions. The faction who believes that exercises are difficult yet necessary, and the faction who thinks exercises are pointless, stressful ventures. If you fall in the second category, well, we'd like you to know that you are kind of wrong. Exercises are helpful. 
perhaps even more helpful than you think. Is this enough reason to spend more money on a gym membership or exercise equipment? Of course! Exercising is great for your mind and body, which is also a way of saying it generally improves your health. Still think exercises are stressful? We don't think so. Whew, that was one beautiful ride. Did you stick with us to this point? Thank you. Here's one more for you. Number 16, insurance. Did you think we weren't going to talk about insurance? Oh no, insurance protects us during emergencies and it keeps us afloat when accidents occur. You never know, your current insurance on your home and business might be the reason you stay afloat during a difficult time. Thanks for spending some time with us today. We are so glad you did. If you found value in today's video, please give us a like. Hit that bell icon to never miss an upload and don't forget to subscribe.